What's going on beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, I know it seems like I've been doing a lot of unboxings and hauls, but don't you guys worry. We're going to get back to the blocks in next week's video. And I just want to say thank you guys for holding me down. Let's get to the unboxing. Uh, as you guys can tell by the title, it's going to be a Saint Laurent unboxing. And if you guys have never seen a Saint Laurent box, here it goes. It's a black box with white writing. And then it also has like, you know, the product code and all the other information that we don't know what it means down here but I'm just to link that down in the description box down below so it's with the black top over here now typically the shoes always comes with two dust bags but I got one dust bag and you know what it is what it is it's not a big deal but I'm pretty sure if this is your guys' first pair of Saint Laurent boots or if you guys ever get one and you only get one you can go to the store and they'll give you some more then you get met with a lot of paper here are the boots these are the Saint Laurent Lucas boot with the double belt buckle uh, the boot features a little bit of distressing on the toe as well as on the heel uh, they just a black pair of suede boots that I was not in the market for you guys I have so many pairs of black suede boots but when I saw these I just knew I had to have them uh, I wasn't really a fan of the Lucas boot when they first came out by Anthony Baccarello I just thought that they were probably a little too Western for me but when I saw my friend kept wearing them and then like you know I kept seeing them I was like yo and then I tried them on I was like yo and they were amazing uh, so it features this like you know this pointed toe definitely size a half size up so I'm always a 43 um, I got these in a 43 and a half I tried on the 44 and they were way too big they were like you know my feet were swimming in them and the thing is with Saint Laurent boots they do stretch so you don't want it to be too big on your feet uh, the reason why I got these specifically instead of like you know the more popular ones the nut suede was because of these two buckles uh, they can be a little cumbersome just because you actually have to take off the buckle they're not like a fake buckle that you know you just pop off you actually have to take the buckle off each and every time you put on the boot and you take them off and then you know you get met with these two right over here which are you know leather on the inside and then you still have the hidden zipper and then there goes your fully leather lined boot uh, I love 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 these boots I just can't wait to wear them uh, again they look a little bit dirty just because I was trying them on on the outside you know just to get this shot for you guys that you guys are about to see uh, but typically what I do is I always get grips put on them so I don't go slipping and sliding everywhere and it makes the boots last longer in my personal opinion I don't treat my boots I don't spray anything on them I just wear them and I enjoy them they have this little slanted wooden heel which uh, makes it more comfortable to walk in them opposed to like you know some of the other ones that are can be very uncomfortable to walk in but yeah that's really all I have to say about these boots as my first impression uh, let me know down in the comments down below let's have a conversation are you guys feeling these boots um, do you guys still like Saint Laurent Saint Laurent out uh, do you guys want me to do a Saint Laurent collection video let's just have you know conversation down below and I'll make sure to link all of the information down in the description box that I mentioned today just in case you guys missed it but I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'm gonna go ahead and get the bottoms put on these boots right now so peace bye guys so I wanted to show you guys how I store my new boots or whenever I get something new like I'm the type of person as soon as I get something new I now want to see it I want to display it because these are typically my art so the first thing I will do is, t is take everything out of the box take out all the stuffing and I'll store the box either in my closet over there or I have another storage room and then I make space on my shelf for the boots just so it can have a home as you notice I don't have any sneakers here just because I always wear sneakers so then we're gonna go ahead and get the bottoms placed on these boots but I also wanted to show you the type of socks that I wear with the boots um, this is like my these are all new socks my brand new sock basket um, I typically like wearing Alexander McQueen socks with my boots just because it fits effortlessly um, these are quite expensive but they always go on sale or if you're not really into spending like let's say 50 bucks on a pair of socks or 40 bucks you can go to Uniqlo I think these cost like ten dollars or three ninety and I'll get something like this and they also work I typically like silkier socks or thinner socks with boots sometimes like I'll get a thicker pair of socks like these are Uniqlo like these these are the thicker pair of like heat tech socks and I like to wear these as well
So you guys, this is the shoe maker repair shop that I go to to get the soles put on my shoes. They can do it in 35, I think, minutes or an hour or less. So let's go in here. <laughs> so these are the different type of Vibram soles. Um, you have to make sure you ask for the thinner ones or else they're going to give you the thicker one. Um, so he's going to go ahead and get them and then you're going to get them placed on the bottom of these shoes. But we don't want this one. Which one's the thinner ones? This is the these are the options. I think I want this one. So let's get this one placed okay. on these. How long is it gonna take? Uh, give me, you the wait, give me 35 minutes. 35 minutes? Yeah. All right, so we're gonna wait. And this is how they came out. Really good. Thank you, beautiful.